The contamination of the supply containers is clearly visible. The containers are completely empty. Adhesive residuals like paper labels are contaminations which are removed by the Neue Herbold recycling system. After the truck has been unloaded, packaging like pallets are removed. A wheel loader feeds the hopper of the two shaft shredder with the bottles and containers. The two shaft shredder operates without the screen. The shredder cuts the containers and bottles to strips of approximately 10 by 30 centimeters. The shredded material drops on to a belt conveyor. Large foreign materials like PC and LDPE are removed manually. A metal detector checks the material stream on the conveyor and stops immediately if iron and non-iron metals are detected. The belt conveyor transports the shredded material to the Neue Herbold bed granulator of the Sirius SM. This type of machine is equipped with special housing sealing and may be furnished with exchangeable wear plates if required. The shredded material is transported to the cutting chamber where up to 5 cubic meter of water is added per hour. The granulator is cutting the material to a final practical size of smaller than 15 mm. Through a discharge tube the material water mixture is transported to the Neue Herbold friction washer. This centrifuge works with up to 3 cubic meter of water per hour and removes further contaminates from the PE flakes. The material stream is then transported to the Neue Herbold Intensive Washer Type IR. In this part of the recycling process, all adhesive residuals and paper labels are discharged together with the water. A blower transports the dried material with a residual moisture of smaller than 1% of its weight to a cascade sifter. This counter airflow sifter separates the material into a LDPE and a HDPE fraction. In the first cleaning step, the recycled water is transported to a screening unit where the separated residuals like paper labels are disposed. 